Good morning, Patriots. Welcome to Rex Pines TV. I'm Peyton Forbes. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations passion and perseverance. Thank you. You may now be seated. Today is Tuesday, May 25th, 2021. Let's go to Annalisa to see what's happened today in history. Thank you, Peyton. Today in history on June 1st, 1980, CNN, cable news network, the world's first 24-hour television news network, makes its appearance on TV and it was the first all-news television channel in the United States. Until CNN arrived, the only option for news was local news shown in the morning and evenings on TV. Since its debut, CNN has expanded its reach to several cable and satellite television providers, several websites, and special channels. Thank you, Annalicia. Today's sports highlights are brought to you by the Patriots. A Chinese student displays insane skills at the World Interschool Rope Skipping Championships. Nobody was more impressive than the 11-year-old Sen Jialin, who skipped an astounding 108 times in 30 seconds. And that is just the count of his right leg jumping over the rope because that is what the judges use for the score. All in all, the young boy managed to skip 216 times during the short period. He was so fast, the judges had to slow the video down to get an accurate count. Now let's go to Noah for the lunch report. Today's lunch is grilled beef steak, yellow rice, soda splash ready juice, diced carrots, mixed fruit, vanilla cookie, and milk. Bon appetit. Now let's go to Sonia for our national segment. Thank you, Noah. Good morning, Patriots. Today is the beginning of June, which is National Candy Month. This month gives recognition to these delectable treats. Some popular candies are Pop Rocks, Chocolates, Peppermints, Twix, Airheads, Dum Dums, Smarties, and more. With this wide variety, there is sure to be a candy for everyone. Don't forget to brush your teeth after eating your sweets. Happy National Candy Month! Let's go back to Peyton. Thank you, Sonia. Scholars, here are a few events coming up this week. Friday, June 4th, is the kindergarten drive through celebration going on from 9 to 10 a.m. Also, this Friday is the 8th grade grilling event. Now let's see what the weather is going to be like today with David. Thank you, Peyton. Today's weather in Pembroke Pines, Florida is forecast to be 84 degrees Fahrenheit and scattered thunderstorms. Looks like the rain is here. Let's hope for some sun, though. Now let's go to summer for the joke of the day. Thank you, David. And here's today's joke of the day. What's the difference between a thug and George Washington? One has a bill on his face, and one has his face on a bill. Now let's go to Solomon for today's birthdays. Thanks, Samuel. That was another great joke. Today's birthday boys and girls are Jaden Comer, Gregory Jean Lewis, Kiana Hartley, Adriana Lalane. Jean Campos, Alexander Villa, and Casey Raphael. Happy birthday! Now let's go back to Peyton. Thank you, Solomon. Patriots, don't forget your past expectations. It represents present yourself positively, act kindly towards others, treat the school's environment respectfully, and succeed at everything. Congrats to Miss I'm Dan Kwa, Miss Calabrese, Miss Anaya, and Miss Stone. You are the correct answer to yesterday's riddle, which was if there are four sheep, two dogs, and one herdsman, how many feet are there? The correct answer to the riddle was two. Sheep have hooves and dogs have paws. Now for today's riddle. If you drop a yellow hat in the Red Sea, what does it become? Again, if you drop a yellow hat in the Red Sea, what does it become? Teachers, please send your answers to pines.renaissance at gmail.com before 10 a.m. in order for your response to be reviewed. Winners will be announced on the next morning announcements. Everyone at RPTV would like to wish you all a terrific Tuesday. And don't forget to remember, reunite, rise. Have a great day.